Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. We're going to go ahead and get started make this morning away. We're going to go ahead, I believe, and start on time. Hallelujah. Glory to God. See, it makes no time to come in this world and do what it did for you and I. That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord. It's been about a week, like I say, you know, Kevin was telling us, you know, how the enemy comes. God, people here come from church, but you know, that know that we live in life. He won't bother you if you ain't living right. That's right. Yeah, because he knows that he already had you then. Yeah. But he knows we living strong for the Lord here at that company. And we gotta we gotta give the Lord our best of a day. Of a day. And pray of a day in faith and keep our faith and believe in what the word of God tells us. Of a word in it is real. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. People might think Jesus Christ is dead. Hallelujah. But I'll tell you one thing, he's alive in spirit. Be serving them in spirit. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. One thing about it, we're here tonight to give him all the praise and all the honor. Yes, honor. amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Man, I feel so good I get back in God's house. It's a whole lot of different atmosphere in here and out yonder. Amen. You can feel better when you're in here than you can out yonder. That's for sure. I feel more Amen. safe in here. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You know, people, you know, I know some have snuck in churches with guns and stuff, you know, and done some things to down in Catalina and different areas, but, you know, we don't, we don't let that bother us. We come to God's house with a clean heart. Hallelujah. Yes. I mean, ready to hear the word of God. Yes, amen. That's what I come for. Hallelujah. I come to enjoy what God got for me. Amen. I ain't worried about the man, El John. I just want to make sure Jesus is where he needs to be in my life. Amen. Hallelujah. That's something we got to check of a, of a day. We got to make sure that he's in the right place in, that, in my life. Hallelujah. Glory to God. We got to praise him with folks. We 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 could live in a, a time now that we gotta we gotta show Jesus more love than we ever have. Yes. And live this life. Live a Christian life. Hallelujah. Sure, we might we want to cause a few bumps, but just give it to Jesus and let him smooth it out. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. We're gonna have a good time in the Lord. I can already feel it. Yeah. Hallelujah. I come to have a good time like Brother yeah. Charlie, Brother Kevin. I come to have a good time in the Lord. Amen. Yeah. Might dance a little bit. We don't know what we're going to do. Amen. We don't know what that Holy Ghost is going to do. Yeah. The Holy Ghost is something else, Brother Frank. That's right. It'll lay you down. It'll lift you up. Hallelujah. It'll make you run. Hallelujah. Yeah. Amen. Oh, God. Make you jump a little bit. I had to take my boots off and didn't even know it over. Oh, Mike Burry still talks about that. Or oh, Winchester. I'm a preacher, man. I mean, Sister Hattie and the Holy Ghost it was on, on me so strong, and I came up around where the star ring was at. <coughs> the steps had come off of it, man. All of a sudden, my legs uh, started jumping, and one boot went one way, one went the other way. Mike took, he ducked his head, and he thought he was going to come back out here. Hallelujah. He, he, he went and told all about it. He said, Boy, that preacher would have preached the matches, but man, the Holy Ghost it was. He was on fire with him. And man said, that he kicked him boots off and said, Lord of mercy, uh, one almost got me. <laughs> <laughs> that, that might have been to raise him up. <laughs> Hallelujah. We don't know what God does. God works mysterious ways, doesn't he? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Well, we feel good tonight. Let us all stand and get this thing underway and praise the Lord. <coughs> Lord, with the God, Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus. We thank you tonight, Lord, and give you all the praise and all the honor. Give us another, another safe week, Lord. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for keeping your hands on Brother Kevin and his uh, uh, people the, the other night, Lord. Other day, Lord, glory to God. And all the others, Lord, and glory to God. Lord, we just thank you, Lord, for that. And Lord, we got a, a Lord, as I put these claws in my uh, pocket tonight, Lord, and pray and, and preach, Lord. And I want to 
got three that I'm going to give these two tonight. Glory to glory to God. Lord, special anointing, Lord. I give my, my, my these be special anointing, Lord. Glory to God. Glory to God. Let them feel your healing when, I, when they give it over to the others, Lord. Glory to God tonight. We give you the honor for that, Lord. Lord, we pray, Lord, that you touch it right now while we're in this service, Lord. Oh. Dry up everything that's not of you, Lord, in the bodies. Oh, Lord, I know you can do it, Lord. Lord, I'm here tonight, Lord, as a, as a merkel. Glory to God, Lord, knowing, Lord, that you can do it, Lord. Lord, if you, if you just speak the word, hallelujah, Lord, to you, Lord, and you and you would do the rest, Lord. Glory to God, there's nothing, Lord, that you won't do for us, Lord. Oh, hallelujah, Lord, that we go at it the right way. Hallelujah, Lord, we ask you right now, Lord, to touch that little fellow, Lord, little Charlie, Lord, as we preach tonight, Lord, this service going out for those tonight, Lord, that's in need. Hallelujah, glory to God, but wherever they may be, Lord, in the name of Jesus. And Lord, we give you the praise for that. Lord, glory to God, because Lord, you have all the authority. Oh, hallelujah. Man, I feel so spiritual tonight. Oh, hallelujah, glory to God. Lord, thank you, Lord, for that good comforter that you give us, Lord. Oh, hallelujah, we thank you for it, Lord. Lord, we thank you, Lord, that Brother Kevin and his... Uh, his others, Lord, and who it was, Lord. Glory to God, Lord. Lord, we cannot thank you enough tonight, Lord, that you're following through, Lord. Glory to God, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. Jesus. And now, Lord, in Jesus' name tonight, Lord, this service, Lord, Lord we come, Lord. And Lord, it's all about you, Lord. It ain't about Pastor Frazier or another of us, Lord. It's all about you, Jesus. Lord, we come to lift up your name. Lord, Lord, we come to receive tonight, Lord. We come to receive from you, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we need all of us need a touch, Lord. All of us need more strength tonight, Lord. In the name of Jesus, glory to be your God. And we thank you tonight, Lord. Oh, hallelujah. Glory to God, we thank you, Lord. Oh, praise the Lord, I feel the Holy Ghost. Oh, shalom, hallelujah. Oh, glory, Lord, we just love you tonight, Lord. Oh, hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we give you all the honor and glory. Lord, keep your hands upon those that's going to be traveling this weekend, Lord, on this, on this memorial to the day, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Lord, keep them safe, Lord. Glory to God. Lord, we pray for a safe holiday in the name of Jesus. Lord, travel tonight this weekend, Lord. And Lord, keep us all safe to and from to your from your willing, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we thank you. And we give you all the honor and glory. In Jesus' name, Amen. amen. Praise the Lord.
you go. I don't like to bring my cell phone to church, but I have to do it. Today I showed y'all pictures of the accident. Yes. Truck. And now, sincerely, I pray every day for health and safety for everybody I know. Yeah. And then when I had the accident, I had two Down syndrome people in there and three autistic. And uh, I don't know if you've ever been in this situation where you you drive up and the sun is directly in your eyes. Mm -hmm. And you can see just a little bit to the left and a little bit more to the right, but the glare was mostly to the right. And to make a long story short, uh, I, was t I just picked these people up a half a mile away and I'm taking them home, right? And a lot of times I say, Lord, is there anything? Please help these people. I I'd like to see them back to normal. I'd like to see them normal and stuff. So I still pray that every day. Yeah. Because, you know, one of them can't talk and one of them has a speech impediment. And, you know, so anyway, uh, so I get down to uh, a half a mile from where I picked them up to a stop sign. And just that time of day, I knew at 8 o'clock in the morning when I take them there, if it's a real bright sunny day, you're looking at it the opposite way too. Right, right. And that sunlight is right directly in your eye. Yeah. So uh, here it was in the afternoon. It's, it's, it's the only time I've ever experienced it in the afternoon. I knew it was there, but it's just the time of day, right? So I, I pull up to the stop sign, and the stop sign is, I don't know why it's put like 20 yards back. And then you then you go down just a slight in, you know a slight hill, and then here's the road. And I stopped short of the road, and I'm, I'm still. I look left, and I can see that there's nobody coming. But it, it it's a shorter way. You better be careful because that's downhill, and it's a short blind spot right there, right? So I'm looking that way, and I look to the right when I pass to this I stop, and I didn't see nobody, right? So then, but then. The glare wasn't there at the stop sign. It was down further here. So I creep down. I go, oh, no. And, and, and so I, I look, and, I, and I'm thinking, this is not good. So I look left real quick, and then I, I look to the right. I can't see nothing, because that, that sunlight's right in your eye. And it's, it's to the windshield, too, right? So um, nothing coming to the left. I creep down. And then, I mean, really creepy. And then I look, I look twice to the left because it's shorter. <laughs> They're coming right from my door, right? So I look to the right, and as soon as my, as soon as I, I got a, maybe a foot or two feet, about two feet over the line, as soon as I, as soon as I drifted, you, you know, your, your front tires are on the yellow line just about, right? That quick that quick after seeing nobody but then I was a little cautious and you know and I'm thinking how long how long did it take for him to go a quarter mile at 55 the speed was 45 he's going 55 and it's uphill can you imagine that and he's pulling a trailer on top of that oh my goodness and so I'm I'm driving in and uh, he's got a, a Ford F-250 pickup truck and they're, they the new ones sit real high and they're real wide and everything well, just to make a long story short, um, as soon as I started to look to the right and crap, I did not see it. I heard it and I felt it. And it, and it, and it took me from this direction to this direction. And, and then I, I, I was like, what happened? What happened? And uh, I just said, you know, Lord. And then, you know, here's a little bit of glare to the side. So I got out and I made, I looked and I go, oh man, I've got hit. All this debris, headlights and bumper in the road. And so, uh, and then I see the truck. He flipped over on his top. So I checked on my group first to make sure anybody in pain, anybody hurt. No, no, they're just sitting like they're going to wait and watch a movie or something. <laughs> just sitting there, all buckled up and everything. And, uh, so uh, another guy stops, and he starts over toward the truck. I said, I'm checking on my group. I'll be over there in a second. So he looks over, and the, the, the man, the driver of that truck, his windshield was down. The airbag was sticking out the driver's window. And we say, sir, anybody anybody in there? Yes, are you awake? Are you alert? Are you, 
Okay, are you hurt? No, I'm okay, I just can't get out. So he rocked it and I, I got the door open and he crawled right out of there. And uh, again, to make a long story short, um, the, the van, the work van, uh, I called the office. It's hard to hear. You ever, you ever been, had all these emergency vehicles come? And you're trying to call the op, your office and other ones, you know, you just decided to walk like 150 yards away just to, just to get used to phone and stuff. So uh, anyway, they towed the, the van back to the, we have a little two garage shop behind the workplace, or our office, where they mechanic, they have a mechanic or two back here. They work on it. Actually two businesses that, that the, they own that involves vehicles and stuff. So they took it back there. And you know, the, when the, when the uh, workers who, who do what I do come back there, and they saw it, and they look around, that's Calvin's van. Where's he at? Is he alive? <laughs> and I had a couple of them call me. Are you okay? Are you okay? I saw the van. And I said, yeah, I, I, I pray every day for health and protection, and the, and the Lord answers yes, prayer. Amen. And, uh, you know, the, the devil don't like that. He, he, he tries true. to wipe you out. I, I can see it right here. He, he's attacked this. He's attacked everybody here. Yes. And you see, yeah. you see who prevails? The Lord. Amen. Amen. Now, uh, the reason I brought myself in, I just want to make a short, uh, a long story short with um, what, what I did with uh, my brother. I sent him a text. And this summarizes pretty much what happened today. Uh, with my wife. Now, Charlie, you asked about my wife. Um, she was invited to a picnic at her former job. She's at. She worked at a daycare, and at, and her last day there was on December the eighth, and then December tenth, she had her brain aneurysm, and you know that got published around for, among the parents and the kids are too little to understand, um, being you know like two two years old, and so. They invited my wife good. today, so uh, I, I got ready for that, and I took her there, and uh, I, I stayed away because I didn't know those people and all that. I just I just let let her let the Holy Spirit work with her and do let her let her do her thing right there, and I was just telling my brother about it. What's going on here? Anyway, here it comes. I sent my brother this email about the situation. Bless you, Lord. Lena, my wife, attended a picnic at her old workplace with parents, kids, and staff today at lunch. Everyone was surprised to see her and, and doing well. Some couldn't believe that she was in the intensive care unit at UVA Hospital being once legally blind and paralyzed and now walking around. She was a big witness for the Lord and amazed some people. Um, her old boss was there, and she went to actually see my wife twice when she was in the hospital. She saw her when her eye was shut. She saw her when she was uh, paralyzed on her left side. To make a long distance, uh, there were lots of tears of joy. Yeah, yeah. praise the Lord. Because when you when you see the person at their worst, and now you see them walking around, they were just jubilant. Let me just tell you that. So yeah, I just I just said Lena had a great time, um, and and you know not to not to talk about our, myself all the time here, but uh, I don't know if y'all been kept watching this in the news, um, just looking at some of the stuff going on. Did y'all see what happened with the tornadoes? There's more warnings this year than has been in a long, long time. Yeah. And it's it was in Greenfield, Iowa. If I'm recalling that correctly. It showed a glimpse of it this morning on the news. A little town called Greenfield in Iowa was, it looked like a trash dump. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. The whole town was gone. It was just a few pieces of things standing. And uh, we don't, and, and the death count is still going on. It was a, a, a category three. So you know what? The angels are holding back the winds of strife. We're living in the last days. Yes. And Amen. the devil didn't actually want me to come here tonight. Because when I got off work, I, I thought I called my wife. I said, "You want to come? Um, she's cooking for my my dad for tomorrow, right?" And I look at on eighty one. It's blocked. 
something's going on. And, and so I couldn't, I couldn't go that way. And then I, I, I looked at another way to get on 81. That was, I mean, it was just a moving parking lot, right? You could uh, actually, uh, Charlie, you could walk faster than traffic was moving today on 81. Amen. Yeah, so that was pretty bad. So uh, it's like you say, you know the Bible, that's your roadmap to heaven. Yep. Yeah. Knowing a few other maps that you got too helps out. So I quickly got on 33 and went down and, and uh, McGackiesville and, and got down and went down to Shenandoah and then down 340. And make a long story, I'm here. Praise the Lord. Yeah. So, yeah, I have no problems when I got out full 33 for getting going those other ways. Yeah. And, you know, we still be careful when you go out because uh, people are going everywhere. Yeah. And you know what they're going to be doing? They're going to be drinking yeah. and everything yeah. else. Yeah. So uh, it's always the bad statistics on some of these holidays, yeah. especially in the summer. And like I say, don't have a fifth on the fourth, but you're going to be yeah. six, yep. six feet under, right? right? So anyway, you just tell people about that and stuff. But I'm thankful. I'm thankful for each person here. I'm thankful to, to be able to come here yes. and worship the Lord with y'all. Mm -hmm. And... Um, you know, uh, again, just reflecting on some of this stuff. Why does the Lord allow some of this to happen? And it makes you wonder. When you see, you're flat on your back, like my wife was. You're on her side. And then, Lord, you're thinking, Lord, what good could come out of this? I saw it today. She witnessed for the Lord. Mm. And there's people there. There's parents and stuff. They've given her. They've sent her uh, cards and stuff like that. She must have a, a stack of cards uh, like uh, that. And, uh, and you know, she couldn't even read them. Mm. Because her, but now she, now they were surprised to see her there. Some of the little kids recognized her. They're just hugs, tears, and Aww. kisses everywhere, right? <laughs> but to then, to then, I'm in the background, and I'm looking, and then I, I, I drop off and just leave them out of their space, right? That's, yeah. that's her world. So I just, I just like that one. And, but you know what? She she did a big witness for Jesus mm. today. Amen. And she would have loved to come here tonight, too. Mm -hmm. And last night we ran into a fellow that I called him on the phone and asked him if he would pray for my wife. We saw him in person last night. And he, he his Whoa. jaw was dropping. Because when I talked to him in December, that's right after she had the mm. stroke. And she became legally blind and paralyzed. And that's something else, you know. I mean... You've been up through a lot, and you've, you've got plenty of stories, and it's tremendous that you're here and everything else. And, um, but when you actually have, instead of hearing about it, when you've actually been there and witnessed everything that goes on, and you, you realize, Lord, it's got to be something in this going to happen. It's, it's, you've, got a, you've got a purpose in this. We can't see it yet, but I saw it today. And um, you know what? It, and, and, and then here's some of my workers again asking me, and they seen the, they seen how damaged the vehicle was, and um, you think you didn't get a scratch? No, no. And I said, but you know what I told them? But you know what I told them? I pray for health and safety for everybody, including my co-workers. Yes, sir. And I said, I pray for you too. And they mm -hmm. go. Oh, well, they didn't know what to say. <laughs> they went, well, thank you. And you know, what, what's happening here in this witnessing? Some people you never hear talk about the Lord. Yeah. And then all of a sudden, it's the opposite way now. Because now they've seen the, the miracle of what happened to my wife. Oh, yeah. yeah. And they're thinking, they're thinking, you know, uh, even one, one lady came up. She goes, it's remarkable where, how far your wife has come. Yeah. And I was said, praise the Lord. She goes, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and you know, and, and then you know what my wife said about that? She used to never hear anything, anybody talk about anything religious. And now that place has turned around, brother. That's good. And thank, thank yeah. you praise for the Lord. Holy Ghost and for everybody for, for making that possible. Praise yes, the sir. Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Brother Calvin. Tell your wife, I'm going to get mine. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Glory to God. You will. That's right. We're praying. We're praying for you too, brother. Y'all got testimony, right? I just like to thank Lord for here tonight. 
I think the Lord kept me safe working working eighty yeah. one like Kelly said today. Yes, he was Lord. around level three he was heading back towards Edinburgh and he got ran hard in the traffic was just like fleas on dog back. Mm -hmm. Hey Frank, I, what do you think? I said, let's, let's turn around and go back to the yard. I said, this traffic is bad. Tuesday I found a guy with a wallet on eighty one. I got down to the weed eating, I always like to walk with that black top and the crowd will find bungee cords. It's a tell where you, you can find I was walking through there, grabbing a few bungee cords, and glanced down, I said, brown. I said, I can't believe this. It was a wallet. Just looked like something, just like mine here. It was sort of brown like that. I picked it up, stuck it in my big pocket. I didn't want to look in it. And I got to where my supervisor was. I said, hey, Glenn, look here. He said, well, you got a wallet. I said, yeah, it's good, damn. Any money in it? I said, I think it's some type of bill. And I, I opened it, it's $5. I said, how much did you get this in the truck? I said, I can bet we see an ID or nothing, we can turn it back to who it belongs to. We got back in the truck, it was a truck driver in Pennsylvania. And then at lunchtime, we ate our lunch, and we'll be at Woodstock, the police station, and turn, turn it in. Well, yeah, they asked me 20, 20 questions, like I took that man's water or something. <laughs> I just explain detail to detail where I fell apart. Yeah. In the jack spot. I think about four or five miles back from Woodstock. Mm -hmm. Southbound headed toward Woodstock. Oh. They don't want to know jack road, road marker bus, I said. I don't know. And he said, well, I think. I said between 288, 286. I said, along that ballpark here somewhere. He said, oh, I direct 288 there. And I figured with the hope being within a week or so, I met here. I had to give my phone number, my address. I mean, maybe the guy would contact me, may not know it. I just let the light shine to the officer. If that was my wallet, I was hoping somebody would teach me. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. You done the right thing. A lot of people want that. So, they don't get that vibe, they don't get that vibe. Right? Yeah, yeah. Somebody told me the other day, I talked to you the other day while I was driving that green truck. So I sort of kept us, no, I think God, people don't do that. Yeah, the Lord, let them pack for we. Yeah. Yeah. You, the one that was, uh, man of God to turn it in. I say, you know, we, we, we got to really be careful because God does work for sure as well. Yeah. Then, and then I need a thing for my phone for charger. I found one was broken. I oh, man, the Lord said, keep faith. I found that wallet. It was the last place we weed eat. I went to get the weed eater out of the truck, back to the truck. The Lord said, look at your feet, Frank. I looked down. There was that piece I needed for my phone and my charger. <laughs> brand, brand new. Brand, brand new. Brand new. God didn't know give you no track. <laughs> Again, the man. This whole thing Amen. Six inches long, but brand new. Amen. 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 Nothing like keeping faith in the Lord. Amen. Okay, brother John, you got uh, you and Haley got a song. You got something to say? Yeah, I uh, I don't have that preach tonight, brother Pedro. Uh, but I'm ready for you to bring your word. Like the. Uh, I'd like to request prayer for a friend of ours. He, he's having trouble with his mind. And this thing that is tormenting him, he says his name is King G, uh, King Victor. King Victor. And it torments him and hurts him, hurts his body and everything, twists him all up. And I went and prayed for him the other day. Uh, I'm going to try to call him tomorrow and stay in touch with him. Amen. It may have to, I can be a light to him, Brother Fraser. Y'all yeah. pray for this man. His name is Hess. And uh, just pray for him. He, he's going through a lot. But, and pray, uh, pray for my grandson. So, and praise the Lord to help him. Uh, just pray for all of my grandchildren. Amen. My great grandchildren. Pray for me and Hattie. Uh, Lord, 
the enemy attacked us the last two days. And man, I, I'm glad to hear you say last night. Uh, the Lord uh, is letting us know that Satan's attacking everybody. Yeah. Hey Amen. He knows he's got for a short time, and that's right. what he's doing. He's, he's, he's trying to make havoc in our life. Hey Amen. Yeah. Calling the strikes and everything. Yeah. Oh, the God. But thank God we got to hold on. We're, we're almost there, Brother Tracy. Yeah. I've never I've never felt such a, a nearness of God as I do now in knowing that he's coming soon. Amen. Amen. And y'all pray about that. I want to try to sing this song here. Amen. Pray for my little, my nephew's little grandson. And keep him in prayer. He's a, he a, he a fighter, brother. Pray. He's a tough little boy. We got that, that Amen. God got his hands on I like I like to say he's got that uh, that Wilson blood in him, but I, I want to say he's got that Jesus blood in him. Yeah. 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 Jesus yeah. is going to pull him through this. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Glory to God. I'm even in to to
praise I wrote that song in memory of my salvation. I remember when I went to the altar. I must have prayed there two and two and a half hours, weeping and crying for the Lord to forgive me and to heal my family, my children. And right after that, they took me to the river and baptized me in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Holy God. You know, today, I've seen people go five years, maybe 10 years, before they get baptized after being saved. You know, you read that word, and that word said as soon as somebody got saved, they took them to the vision. Yes. They I had it done quickly, didn't they, Brother Frank? I believe in that. They may have had it done quickly. Yes. Holy God. That's what we ought to be about. Someone gives their life to the Lord, get them to the river, get them baptized. The word says, take them to the river, get them baptized, and they shall be filled with the Holy Ghost. Yes. Amen. Amen. Holy God. Amen. I'd love, I'd love to have another baptism. I used to say it, baptize them, baptize them. I'd love to have another one. Lord, won't you send it to people so I can have my baptizing? Holy God, in the name of Jesus. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Amen. And Michelle, Jason Christ, Michelle, uh, but just laid on my heart to pray for her. Amen. So remember Michelle. Yes. Glory to God. <laughs> Hallelujah. God have mercy. Anybody else? How about you? Ready for the word? Amen. Mm -hmm. yes. That's the main part of the, of the service. Yes. God's message. Hallelujah. Oh, Feel good about this tonight. Amen. Lord. Come on, brother. We're gonna, Give me the word. We're going to go into it. I need that word tonight. When God promises you something, He does it. Yes, right. amen. But you know, when people promise you stuff today, you can't count on it. Oh, yeah. Unless it's a very, very, very good, true friend oh, of yours. And, oh, and you know, and living the life like you live it. Oh, the God. That word. You know, uh, it's nothing, it's no better life to live than living for Jesus. Amen. I've been there, I know that. I've been there. And I'm just so thankful tonight that oh, the Holy Ghost God. put me back with the Lord where I really needed to be. I just thank you to God tonight I'm living a life that, that's not worthy. Amen. Hallelujah. Today I gotta do things and, 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 uh, and, and claim that I'm a Christian and not and doing things that I shouldn't be doing, I'm going to quit. Because I don't believe in, if, you, if you're going to either live it, don't play with it. That's right. We either got to live it or don't live Amen. it. Amen. This is something not to play with. Mm -hmm. God does, he, work, he can bring you down. I mean, I did, this is no play toy. That's right. This thing is real. Amen. A lot of people use it for a playhouse, but this is not no playhouse. It's victory in Jesus. Yes, amen. amen. Come on, Brother Faith. Oh, I feel it tonight. Open your Bible, John 14. Thank oh, you, Holy God. Yeah, hallelujah. We're going to, yeah, not like say when Jesus promises or something, Brother, he, he sticks to his word. Yes, he does. Amen. You know, when he spoke to us here at the, at the, at the church, Brother Cabin, and said that you, your wife was going to be healed, you know, he said that it was already healed. But you know, glory to God, but we got to claim what the Word of God tells us. <laughs> if, it wasn't, if it wasn't for Jesus, what he, what he said that, you know, I, I was healed. 
I wouldn't be in here tonight. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. We can be here for a living God. I mean living God. Hallelujah. We're going to start by the 15th verse. Of 14th chapter of John. Hallelujah. Brother Charlie, he was singing that song. He was close to what I'm going to be preaching. Hallelujah. And praise the Lord. You know, God is so good. And I got here tonight, I opened up to John 14 and looked down. Oh, and that's the Lord's folks are giving to him tonight. Oh, Hallelujah. Let this message be to help me. Praise the Lord. But the 15th verse of the, of the word of God tonight in John 14 said, If you love me, keep my commandments. That is something that Jesus Christ really looks down on you and I oh, to see if we are obeying his commandments. Yes, amen. He, he, looks, he looks down on us the other day about this. Do you really, when we really got Jesus on the inside, we got him, I mean, we know that he is our Heavenly Father. We, we can get the answers that we need. Glory to God, what we need, spiritual, whatever it is, the answer is on the way. It's right here. All you got to do is open your Bible and look in to find it. You know, it's a scripture in the Word of God, but might. It, we might not. He, it's a scripture now for me. It's a scripture now for you. You know, God uses us different ways. Amen. That's what I'm saying tonight, Lord. My my scripture might be something uh, stronger or softer than yours, but the other than it, it is, it, it's from the Lord. Amen. Amen. You, know, you know, when He said, "Go to the Father," and then He come back to you and I. You know, glory to God. That is something tonight, folks. That Jesus Christ. He. You know, a lot of people. A lot of people that ain't put no. Uh, 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 I mean, I'm talking about church folks that used to be in church. They they looked down you know, and they, they they knew what Jesus said over in the book uh, in the Word of God that we were healed by His strife. And they, they get sick and they get down. First thing they do, they lose faith and begin to Lord. I thought you said I will heal. Well, you you you're not healed because you wasn't claiming. You, you let go of it. You let go of it by uh, 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 letting faith go and believe in what God's Word says. Amen. God's Word is real, folks. Yeah. I don't care who likes it and who don't like it. I know of it word in this Bible is true Amen. because I'm a witness here tonight knowing that the Word is true. When Jesus said, you know, glory to God, He was set us free, hallelujah, glory to God. He said, we shall live and not die. And what the, and what the Bible say? Uh, Hallelujah. When we, lose, when we die in this old flesh body, our, our, our soul, which we're going to live in, the, uh, we're going to a spiritual body, and we're going to live by the Spirit. Oh, God. Hallelujah. We live by the spiritual God today. Hallelujah. And he said in the next verse, and he said, I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter. Take mm -hmm. me to the Father. We, he, he seen that we need something. He, he seen that we needed this comforter. Amen. Hallelujah. And you know, in that comforter tonight, Brother Charlie, it's something that glory to God. You need to hang with us. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And he said, a comforter that, that he that he may abide with you forever. Yes. You know, the Holy Ghost is something tonight that we all must have. You know, the Bible says we all should receive the Holy Ghost. Amen. The Holy Ghost is a, it's a, our help. It's our help to keep us strong in the Lord Amen. in order to make heaven our home. Amen. I'm this message tonight is for somebody out yonder tonight, glory to God, that's not believing what the Word of God will really, really say. I'm telling you tonight, glory to God, you better start believing and don't. That's a, that's something that's going to happen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I'm here to give you what God gives me. Amen. And it's the good news. Jesus is good news. Amen. Hallelujah. Ain't no bad news of it, Jesus. All good, all good news. Hallelujah. But you know, Jesus, hallelujah, and you know, tonight, I mean, he, he, he's up on the, the night looking down on you and I. He, he looking down and see that we all be really, all be really he knows, he knows in our heart are we really giving Him all the credit. 
Bless him, Lord. I feel his spirit every day. Bless him, Lord. I work by him. They go down. I don't mean I don't work by myself. I don't. I don't I've got nobody to with me. But uh, Jesus, He's down with me. I'm a war gun. Hallelujah, brother Charlie. I ain't got a thing. Uh, you know, I, uh, by myself, if I'm going to sing or uh, uh, pray, what well, I want to do, I got time to do it. That's one good thing about working for myself. Hallelujah. You know, a lot of jobs, you know, the, the, the superintendent come by and catch you standing in the corner uh, praying, and you're hitting for you, you know. Hallelujah, because you're praying to the good Lord, you know, but uh, they take for me. Hallelujah. Lord, give me something that go to God, work by myself. He's with me. Hallelujah. Nobody come in there and. If, if the man owns the apartment of the house what well, I'm painting it, if you don't like what I'm doing, all you gotta do is say so and I put my tools in the box and come on back up the road. That's what that's how I feel. I started to do that this week. Praise the Lord. But anyway, um, I'm trying to um, keep things right. Hallelujah. Okay. Uh, the, 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 right here is a very important scripture. To even the spirit of truth whom the world cannot receive because it see him see him not. Glory to God. Neither knoweth him, but ye know him, for he dwelleth in you, and you shall be in he for he dwelleth with you and and, and shall be in you. Amen. That scripture that I tell them, folks, the glory to God, we got to be right for Him to live in us. Man, I've been just jumping up and down and running and speaking in some of these tongues they said you're speaking in, glory to God, and living for the devil all week long. That's right. That's not the Jesus Christ I know. Amen. That's not the Holy Ghost I know, Brother uh, Kevin. The, the Bible said, Jesus, I would not live in the unclean temple. Amen. Hallelujah. You know, there's a lot of cleaning up out there in the Christian world tonight that's got to be done. Yeah. There's a whole lot of cleaning up out there that's got to be done. And, and, and people's homes got to be cleaned up. Hallelujah. Glory. But we got to keep this home here clean all the time. Yeah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. You know, I, I'm, you know I, I'm not, I'm not uh, I'm putting nobody down. I'm trying to help somebody out there in YouTube somewhere. I feel in my spirit it's going to help somebody because we cannot play with God. we got to be real with God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Cool. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my. I'm telling you to pray. Go with the God. Uh, but, 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 but brothers, hallelujah, glory to God. And you know, if we, if we, if we, if we, if we you know, we, we uh, got the uh, sickness in our families, you know, glory to God. It's time that we got to believe that it had already been done. And, and, and Jesus said, if you pray, it shall be done. Hallelujah. We got to believe that. Hallelujah. We not believe in the word of God by families. Our children is not going to get real because we not believe in what the word of God said. We got to believe for our family to stay waiting. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory we got to put all our effort in this thing. Yeah, but, uh, people ain't putting effort in, in serving the Lord no more. They think it's all right. It's because, you know, Brother Kevin, that I say this to the day that the Lord takes me home. You know, because the Bible said if you, if you sin and they Jesus to forgive, you, 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 he'll forgive you. They, they live it on that scripture. You know, they, they, they think it's all right to go out and do whatever they want. Oh, I got Jesus. He said, if I make a mistake, he'll forgive me. But, you know, we don't make mistakes if we make mistakes. We, 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 we live in the way the Bible comes to say. we got to live a clean life, amen. You know, the, the people going to get in trouble one of these days when they think they can bring in and do something wrong and ask for forgiveness. They ain't going to be there. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm like I'm saying tonight. It's better to not try to serve God. If you're living for the devil and at God's same time, pick Jesus Christ and live for him and get rid of the devil, but we can't live for both. The devil got so many people weak minded. He done satisfied his own self. The devil done satisfied the fit people. Hallelujah, not even on Jesus that time. But that devil man, he got him, he got him believing so much dumb stuff. 
glory to God is like do this, I can do that. I, I'm gonna tell you tonight, folks, it ain't the one way to live is like, and that's the way to live it, to live it all the way. Yeah, well you call me you think you missed a perfect? I did not say that. I did not say that. I said we gotta live a clean life. To get what we really need here tonight. It's gonna be it's it's it's, it's gonna be it's, it's it's gonna come on. It's gonna come down, brother Charlie. But you know that's that's why in the night, folks, I keep all these scriptures in my heart. It comes back to me a whole lot. That's in that scripture where Jesus said, Men are tall, but a very few are gonna be chosen. Yeah. Them the pure hearted Christians. Amen. The one that lived that life that Jesus lived. Amen. I can't live it for you. Yes, you can. You live it. You want to live it. Uh, have mercy on me. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Praise the Lord. Lord. And you know, I, uh, yesterday I, I fell for this young man. Oh, God. Come to pump seven. Really I've never seen a boy talk so much in my life. He talked to me. I talked my ears off the whole time. He one night, but for long. Oh, but anyway, he cursing. I, I think he done smoked some marijuana or something. He boy, he mean he was high as a Georgia man. And he looked over at the car tag. He said, "Brother, you got the right tag on that." He said, "Jesus is a handsome." But you know, I, I, I left it alone. Lord, Lord, Spirit wouldn't let me. You know, really to say. I said, "Yeah, that means everything he says to." I said, "He's the only answer in this world today." God. Then back, 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 doing the same, same, same things. Uh, I, 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 I felt, I felt, I feel a for him. But the Spirit, God, the Lord, the Lord's Spirit sometimes, you know, he, He'll hold you back. I need you to God knows who. Yeah, I, I really believe my heart, God knows who's going to say, listen yeah. to you in a half. When you talk about Jesus Christ, God, He loves me. I had him, I had him come out and tell me many times, Christ, I don't want to hear that now. I said, Man, don't you want to say that? Lord, He loved His wife, and that little boy loved him. Our heart. Hallelujah. Look, God. <laughs> okay, let's go. He said, oh, I will yeah. not, I will, I will not leave you. Come to us. I will come to you. Oh, God. <laughs> Yet a little while in the world, and in, in the world, seeth me no more. Oh. He said, a little while. He didn't say a, a long time. He said, a little while. But ye see me because I live, ye shall live also. That, that's living. This ain't acting up to life. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. Oh. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank Jesus. Help me, Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Help my Lord. Thank you, good Lord. Praise the Lord. Help whatever it is that can be. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The name of Jesus. It's in that day. In that day, <laughs> ye shall know oh, God. that I am oh, God. in my Father, and ye in me, I and I in you. Yes. How many, how many know in your heart tonight that you got Jesus? <laughs> we got to know it. Yes. Just like I'm saying, we got to know that we say it. Yeah, well, Man, great things is that night. I don't want to be playing around God. Uh, Brother Frank, the dollar churches don't have what we got. That's right. Mm -hmm. They don't have what we got. Uh, we believers in this building. Yeah. Miracles in this building. Yes, there are miracles in this building. <laughs> Other things that we need is right here. Because he's here. Uh, Amen. A lot of these people think Jesus in, in, some, in some of these places. He's not. Oh, yeah. But we know he's here. Amen. Because he came in to us. Yes, amen. That's right. <clears throat> so that, that comfort. <laughs> he came in with us tonight. Mm -hmm. How
Hallelujah. That's why he's with us. That's why he's with us 24-7. Thank God. Yes. He's dying 24-7. Yes. Just in case that you and I call on his name. Mm -hmm. We get the answer like that. <laughs> we get that touch like that. Yes. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. We got something oh, in the night God, called the night. that the world can't give. That's right. We got something that the world can't give. Jesus can. He can give us anything that we ask for. Yes. But you know, you know, uh, uh, if if we if we get down in the night and say we uh, that we need a a help, and you call for somebody from out in the world that that glory to God that don't even have uh, you gonna get what you call for. Amen. If you call, if you call for nothing, you are gonna get nothing. If you ask for something, you are gonna get something. Hey, I'm gonna tell them like it is, brother Kevin. I don't back down from preaching the gospel. I give them the truth. Hallelujah. Yeah. Glory to God. They can't, if they, they don't want to listen to it, they can turn it off. Hallelujah. But Jesus is going to turn it right back on. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I'm telling you, at that one time, we, 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 the guy that uh, vied with us in the van, and uh, God, God was going on, and Come all of a sudden, he, he reached over. I mean, he seen I was talking to somebody else. He turned that thing down. I don't say nothing to him about it. All of a sudden, that thing got back loud, just like his mic was going. Hallelujah. Yeah. That, that video just come right back up. <laughs> and I, I'm laughing to myself. Boy, devil, you can't, you can't, you, you might turn it down, but God got a way of turning it back up. Okay. Hallelujah. You can't stop God's work, brother. You can't stop it. You go over to God. I'm telling you tonight, give up power now. Hallelujah. Devil ain't got no power. Amen. I hear, I, you know, even, you know, we got Christians today, it's, 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 it's uh, 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 uh Worry about the devil more than the than the sinner. Yeah. We got Christians today that not believing in God. What do you what do you mean by that? If you believe in God, you wouldn't get up and go to the doctor every time you sneeze. It's gonna get so you ain't gonna be able to go to no doctor. Right. So the only doctor we're gonna have, Jesus, the best doctor there, don't cost you nothing. Amen. He saved your money. But people don't, they don't trust in God. They go about it. Man, I spent my last dollar this morning for cough medicine. Doctor tried to get a thing called. Pretty sure he got it from Jesus. Amen. For free. Yes, sir. I'm going to call it nothing. Uh, faith uh, and belief. Yeah, but Charlie, I'm telling you, brother, I thought all my faith and belief in the Lord. <laughs> Hallelujah. Bless That's why I stay for the help. Bless the Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. I'm not one for Jesus, like I say. I, I, I never came out of that accident in the shape I'm in today. I could have lost my leg. Holy God. I couldn't take it, but they, at least they saved it because of the nerves and muscles up in it so bad. Hallelujah. But the Lord gave me the best. He is the man. Yes. Amen. Praise the Lord. If we just could get people of the night, we just could get them to come in and sit down. Just sit down in the service. And just listen. Just listen. That's all I ask them to do. He'll do the rest. Yeah. Okay. And they're ready to be set up. They might not be ready the first time they come. Let them come on. It might take it might take five, six, ten times for them to come. Yeah. But they, if 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 they thirsty, they're gonna get you. Yes. Amen. If they're hungry, they're gonna get you. But they're not hungry no more. They're not gonna get you. Yeah. I stay hungry for the word. When I'm down, you know me and her. When I'm not working, uh, at least we be the night. But other morning we be together. And that night and then we be together. Man, I mean, you, you can't you can't beat it. It's something that other day is different. Man, something other day you read it different. Mm -hmm. It gives and sometimes gives you a better feeling than the Lord. Yes, that's the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. You got to feed the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Hallelujah. I use your testimony this uh, week at work. I, I use that. your testimony as a witness. Yeah. At work. Uh, okay. Have you got an everything and your church? Black, the uh, I said, oh, yeah. I said, I told you, it's 
That's right. Do you call all the Oh, hey, he's a daily Thomas. Let him come to church. <laughs> yeah. And he, he can see, he can see oh, what you're talking about. That's right. <laughs> he, he, I've been telling him he's busy enough. Try to plant that seed, you know. Yeah. Yeah, he, uh, uh, Frank, don't work with him. He's going to get some of them in here. Tell all of them. Oh, yes, sir. God. God bless you for it, brother. Yes. The more people that we get to and around and lift up His name, the, the more we are free of. I'm telling you, the blessing. Blessing is on the way. No time you tell somebody about Jesus. I never hear that. God, I got another few weeks to be on fence. I get graduate. Right. That seed bigger and bigger and bigger. Praise the Lord. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. God. Let me read this a little bit more here. Oh, he that has my commandments and keepeth them, he it, he it is that loveth me, and he that loveth me shall be loved of my Father, and I will love him, and will manifest myself to him. Then we come on down in here, Judas said unto him, not, not, not I said, Lord, how is it that thou will manifest thyself into us and not into the world? Jesus always got a good answer. Amen. He always got an answer for us mm -hmm. if we just read to get the answer. Yeah. Amen. He, Jesus answered and said unto him, talking about your if a man love me, he will keep my words. Are we keeping them? Man, some of this stuff I hear, man, from uh, people that sit in the pews, law and mercy, I think it's still law. Because I know the law. When you get saved, when you get saved and, 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 and Jesus don't work all your sins away, you won't have that worldly talk. You can have a Christian talk yeah. like Jesus. Man. A godly talk about what I'm trying to say. Yeah, it's holy. Go over to God. Ain't going to be nothing worldly about it. Because Jesus is not the out of the world. We might live in it, but we're not of it. So, you know, we, we got something here that we can look at, folks. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus ain't said it to him, if a man love me, he, keep my, he will keep my words and my father we will love him and we will come into him and make our, our bow with him. He that loveth me not keepeth not my sayings and the word which ye hear is not mine but the Father which sent me. Yes. Amen. Our Lord and Savior. Hallelujah. God the Father. Hallelujah. These things I have spoken unto you, being yet present with you. But the Comforter, which is the Holy Ghost, whom the Father will send in my name. Here we go, Charlie, in, in Jesus' name. Talk about Jesus here. He, he shall teach you all things and bring all things to your remembrance. Whatsoever I have said unto you. Amen. What I have said in last you, Lord. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you, not yes. as the world giveth. Give I unto you, let not your heart be full, neither let it be afraid. Don't be afraid to speak, don't be afraid to lift up Jesus, glory to God. The, the devil ain't nothing but a pure, pure, pure bar. Glory to God. And I'm telling you tonight, glory to God. You take people in the mall, they act like they're scared to pick the Bible up. They, they, they're scared to go to Bible. They're scared to get up and testify. You know, when I was coming up, you know, other body it was testimonies spoken all night long. Now you gotta ask them to testify. You know, that that's you know, we got Jesus in us, we should be ready to get up and testify. You know, glory to God. You know, over in the churches, man, I'm talking about 70 to 300 people. 
Oh, my nethers one time that took me that oh, used both buildings. Hallelujah, glory to God. I mean, we didn't, we didn't go, it wasn't no slack time. We went down to praise the Lord. From the time we praised it to the time the word come forth, and then when the word come forth, we were standing all night long praising God. Uh, you don't see that no more, Brother Charlie. No. I've been to a lot of different churches. We remember we revival old Flint Hill, very few standing. Amen. And that was a powerful revival. Wasn't that right? Amen. Very few standing, Brother Frank. We got to start praising the Lord to get to get what we need and stay strong in the Lord. Glory <laughs> to God. Hallelujah. <laughs> He's not gonna bite you. <laughs> hallelujah. Yes, hallelujah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Oh, Charlie that boy, he 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 him and, 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 him and Hattie, they sung, boy. I mean Bobby called on me. Mm -hmm. See, I love hearing my singers tonight. Oh, oh, yeah. Call them call him his singers. Yes. Singers. Glory to God. Have mercy, Lord. Oh, Have mercy. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have a couple of This message tonight that should touch somebody. I mean, it's it's felt 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 amazing. It's felt what like Jesus said. Do this. My goodness, man, I tell you. He said, and Jesus is speaking here again, he said, you have heard how I said it to you, I go away and come again into you if you love me. Ye will rejoice. Because I said, I go into the Father, uh, for my Father is greater than it, uh, greater than I. Amen. That's true. Man, I mean, this was this work. And now I have told you before, it come to pass that when it is come to pass, you might believe. You got a lot of people still tonight that you know I doubt that you know that they, they they can't believe the Lord did all this for me, but He did. I, I told him I said no, man didn't do this, God did. It. You got people out there tonight that the, the enemy got them so blinded. Sure, they might be sitting in a pews on Sunday morning, but the devil still got them so blinded they don't know whether what they believe. They don't know what they believe in, Brother Kevin. You know I'm telling the truth. The enemy got them that day and believed in life before they believed Jesus. Yeah. I'm serious, brother. Yeah. I'm serious in my heart. Yeah. They believe in life before they believe Jesus. It's going to get worse unless they come, start coming here and listen to words like we're listening to tonight. I mean, hey. It, 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 something's got to happen. That's why I'm at the, 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 my uh, 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 brother Turo under for Michael Paul. You know, when he said, give, Lord, give him a hundred. No, he said, just, just go ahead and make a hundred twenty-five. But you know, I still say this is going to be the, 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 the end time church. We don't know what we might got to do here. The Lord might bust these walls out. Make it where it, it, it'll hold his people. The Lord did it, but he made this one like he did now. He, he can make it very free once. Amen. But it's going to be up to you and I the way we the way we live this. If we not living it, God ain't going to send us no more people to his seed that we live in. Yep. That's a God's proof of my other said it tonight. I know it in my heart. I've been there, I preached all the places. And I've seen what God can do. 
and what it won't do. And I took over uh, Cameron Street over in Manchester on the other bridge. Prayed we'd be beeped. I'd be beeped double, double. I said, oh, devil, God. you know who I'm you got. I'd be beeped in the name of Jesus. But I'm off and let that fall. But you don't have no say so here. I'd be beeped you. And I know neither the other preacher don't say that. Man, we got we got things on the floor. I said, Jesus, whatever you give me, I'll speak. It could be sometimes, it could be off. But Paul ain't gonna want to pray if they really love him. That's right. They love Jesus. I like it too strong, brother. Frank. Amen. Hey, strong with it. I mean, I, I I just like going to, to throw that ball just a little bit harder. Amen. If I strike it up, I strike it up. If I don't, I, if, if, if I keep a good uh, eye on it, I, I'm gonna I'm I'm smack it every time it comes up to me. Oh, I love yeah. it. But the Bible, I'm in something here I cannot let go of. I'm in something I can't let go of. It's got a hold of me. That's all. It's got a hold of me. That's right. Amen. That could go hold of Yes. But listen, who will who will ever want to turn down the Bible? Oh, for the God. word of it. And not the Bible. Somebody, somebody got to be out of the mind. I'm, I, I'm so glad I found it. I found it years ago when we were little. I didn't know I was going to grow up doing what I'm doing now. I knew I, I knew I was called, but my, I tried to hide it. I tried to get back. Okay, I, 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 I'm going to let you go here just a little bit. I like that scripture about just made. Come to pass, he might believe. Bless him, Lord. Hereafter, I will not talk much with you, for the press of this world coming, and have nothing in me. We all know what the prince of the world is. Uh, yep. We know who he is. Amen. Hey, you know, he tried to talk to Jesus like he does us. Yeah. But don't do him no good. He wastes time. He's a loser. Mm -hmm. Folks, he's a loser. Yeah. Amen. We got more power than he had. That's why I'm saying we, we should never go around and saying, I, you know, I don't know why Jesus didn't do this when he already done done it. Yes. But it's your fault you're not believing what the, uh, what our Lord and Savior is saying in his word. You know, glory to God. I tell people, you know, they come to me that uh, uh, I pray about it, and you know, I, I don't know why Jesus didn't answer me. You know, you don't give time to answer. You know, sometimes He can do it like then. Sometimes He's going to let it ride. Just see how strong we are in Him, and see how much we do trust in Him. People too dumb today to realize that. Yeah. We got to wait on the Lord. The Bible said, wait on the Lord. It didn't say run from the Lord. It said wait on the Lord. Amen. We're not waiting on the Lord no more to get the answer that we need. Yes. Amen. But then you want to call the preacher, man. You want to call the preacher, and, hey? Uh, you know, I, 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 I pray, but you know, God not give me no. God won't talk to me. I said, do you put your heart in the Lord? Are you really trusting in the Lord? Do you believe in the Lord? Yeah. I said, if you believed in it, He would have done it. He don't let nobody down. Amen. Amen. In the mind. It does. It makes, it makes you sick. Blessed be that holy man. But you still got to love him and deal with yes. him. God. You don't, you don't, you don't love what you, you love it. We got we to make sure that that soul, Jesus is counting on the soul. Amen. It don't, it don't cost you a penny. One thing, gas that we spend and we come back forth to the building of God, He always provides us. We always got a dollar to, to get, put gas in the tank, don't we? That's right. That's called we trust in Him. He can take an empty tank and put a half tank. Yeah. 
He can take a half tank for a full tank. I done been done. Many times on the interstate. Oh, God. Coming back from some of them places. Neil. Them bypasses. Late in the morning. All done praying. The Lord, you look at my knee. I'm a struggle of going to be a place, Lord. I'm not going to make it. He's going to fix it. Man, we get talked about it. Everybody, everybody took a long ride on the road. Next day, no road down. Four to the hand. Eight to the hand. Be in there. He took all that union blood and made gas out of it. Amen. That's the kind of God that we serve. Yes, amen. I'm telling you the God of truth. The night I've been there. Other people oh, seen it. The road with me. Seen that gas hand come up. Witness to it. See, God always gave you witness. Amen. He was saying, ain't no way. I said, yes, it is a way. Because he's the way. <laughs> Amen. 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 Said the Lord used me. I just, I just said, come on back with me. Because he is the way. Amen. Praise the Lord. I'm about ready to stop here tonight. Be down to the last one. But folks, I know we believers in the church. <clears throat> Let's start putting a bit more effort in the Word of God. Yeah. To look, Lord, other day from here on. Say, Lord, I just need more of you. And watch how you bless your home. I need more of you, Lord. So I can give to others. Mm -hmm. And he'll bless you. He's a blessing God. Amen. Hallelujah. But that the world may, but that the world may know that I love the Father, and as the Father gave me commandment, even so do I arise and let us go hence. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna stop right now. I got enough. I I I, I felt my belly begin to pump. Oh, God. But y'all, I found my belly pumping that little bit tonight. I got full. I come to get full. I come to get fed. Yeah. And he filled it. Hallelujah. Bless you, God. Glory to God. Bless you. But anyway, the, I, I know it's a toss here tonight. And, 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 and you gave a good word to do it with Praise the Lord. Y'all that one, uh, you and Hay, uh, stand up. I'm, I'm, I'm going to give one to a little child. And um, let me see how many more that we're going to do. Okay, you go down. You know, I'm going to give you this. I want to keep it. I want you to keep this in your oh, oh, yeah. when you're grabbing. I want. I want you to put it in your sun visor of the morning. You want to pray for Mr. Ken? Then, um, Lord, I obey you tonight, Lord. I obey the Spirit. Lord, it's been praying over this, Lord. The whole time I've been praying, Lord, I've been hanging on, Lord. To get up this little one called child. Uh, Matthew, son, Matthew. Red son, and Lord, right now, Lord, I feel uh, you working. Lord, dry up. That new team and that uh, Lyme disease, Lord. Yeah, Lord, they are. They're that it's 
stop that, Lord, and glory to God that they already been healed. Yes, oh, hallelujah, Lord. Lord. We the believe in the church. Lord, let it happen, Lord. Let it, let it, let it as Grandfather said, Lord, uh, uh, in the name of Jesus, that maybe it will draw him closer. And he can we get him here with us and he can fellowship. Yeah. Put, Lord, put him in a believing house, Lord. Yeah. Lord, we gotta get it in, in, in our hearts, Lord. Amen. To believe, Lord, glory to God. Oh, so glory to God in the name of Jesus. Lord. And Lord, the granddaughter tonight, Lord, in the name of Jesus, Lord. Thank you, Lord, what you did for her, Lord. By praying, Lord. In oh, the name of Jesus. Jesus. Come through that name. Yes, Lord, Lord. God, in Jesus' name here tonight. Jesus. Lord, when you know, Lord, you got believers in this house. Yes, Lord, you put Lord. us here, Lord. Lord, you put me in to pray, Lord. Lord. And Lord, Lord you God. know that glory to God has never let you name. In the name of Jesus. I obey you, Lord. In Jesus' name. Let that little fellow be made whole. Yes, Lord. Oh, my <laughs> I'm a believer, Lord. Yes, I'm going to say you Okay. Melissa, I'm going to get one for your father. I hope you, when you give it to her this time, that she will bleed from here on. Well, my daughter, yeah. she's not talking to me or seeing me. Oh, she's not? She's cut off all communication. Well, you, you can take it home and pray over it. Maybe that, that, it'll do it better way. Okay. It, it'll work. Brother Kevin, I got one for you here tonight, brother. I, I feel I feel hurt that you do this. Don't hurt me. Come up, Brother Frank. I'm going to have to pray. Charlie, come over here. I'm, I'm giving Frank one. I mean, Brother Kevin wanted to put in his vehicle that he hauled in people in. Uh -huh. That the Lord would keep a, keep that sun from blinding them and keep us great right away for him. Come on, Lord. Put that on up in you, Lord. Lord, as I deliver your work, Lord, over to this brother tonight, Lord. <laughs> Lord, over to God, Lord, you spoke. In the name of Jesus. In the spirit. Oh, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord oh. God. <laughs> yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, put it in your, over your sunbass and keep it with you all oh, the time. No, yes. Lord, Lord, it's, you got, it's gonna be Protect one of the, it's Lord. gonna be one of the best things that you ever done. Have to keep everybody <laughs> safe, like in the name of Jesus. But go to God, Lord. You know what you're doing, Lord. You work mysterious right oh, Lord, Lord bless his brother. Bless his brother, Lord. Glory yes, to God. Lord. Having concern for these folks, Lord. In the name of God. You put him in the right place so he can be a, a witness for you, Lord. Amen. In the name of Jesus. You don't want us to be hurt. Oh, you want us to stay healthy God. in you, Lord. Yes, in the Jesus. name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, glory to God. This is Hallelujah. helping him to protect him, Lord. Yes, and to want to abide with him, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. It shall be done. In your name, Lord, because you said, well, other than the Father in thy name, he'll do it. Amen. Oh, hallelujah. In Jesus' name, it's already done. Amen. Yes, Lord. You know, Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. And your wife, she, she's doing good. So, Jacob. you know. Um, Jacob, all of my, all of my, all of my. Just she go, go, go. Thank you, Lord. Come here, brother. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, as I give her this, Lord, she says she's not speaking. But, Lord, she can still pray over this, Lord. And your word travels, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Pray, sister, in the name of Jesus. Of a time you pick it up to pray. Lord, yeah. over my daughter, it's, it, it's, it's not obeying and accepting from me, Lord. Lord, make it just a little bit warmer, Lord, to go in the name of Jesus. Lord, make a, make a misery if you have to, Lord, so she do got to call on her mother and for prayer. And, Lord, Amen. I would soon, Lord, that she call on you, Lord, Lord and somebody that glory to God that can save her soul. And, and, and if she just believe, Amen. we got to get that belief in her, Lord, somehow, Lord. Yes, but, Lord, it's all in your hands, Lord, and I know her mother's going to pray over this. Glory to God, Lord, and you look and see, Lord, Lord, glory to God. Because, Lord, we don't want you to turn nobody over to a reprobate mind, Lord. Amen. But, glory to God. Lord, you're doing a lot Amen. of good lately. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, let her be a listener and believe what the mother has to say. This cloth is, it ain't going to do it. It's you, Lord, that's going to do it. <coughs> this represents your Lord, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Shall I hear one more? Thank you, Lord. Know Hallelujah. It must have been for Hattie's granddaughter. Hallelujah. I know I, I know I, I know I know I know it. 
But they can give it to you. Your granddaughter says. All right. Everybody good? Amen. Everybody feel like you've been in church? Amen. If not, we're going to start over. <laughs> Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. I think I can go a couple more hours. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This is the safest place we can be in. Yes. All right. Pray get the altar. Then I'm going to let you go. Keep everybody safe and well during this holiday in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.